Roy Carroll was between the sticks then. Tim Cahill will take the first penalty. And if you're new to this, five each. And if the scores are still level after that, we go to sudden death. Tim Cahill, an FA Cup finalist against Manchester United five years ago in Millwall colours, was the scorer of an FA Cup semi-final winner for Millwall that took them to that final. Here we go. It's Cahill. It's over. Well over. Well, he had the issue about the placement. Mike Riley twice told him to get it back centrally on the spot. Oh, that's poor. Right underneath it, and he's gutted. Well, there's time to recover when you miss your first penalty. Dimitar Berbatov, who was on the spot for Tottenham Hotspur on this ground in the Carling Cup final last year, will take the first Manchester United penalty against the former Manchester United goalkeeper Tim Howard. Berbatov, save, lazy penalty, easy save. Well, they look great when they go in, when you do something like this, but you know when it comes off like that, that, that is an absolutely shocking penalty. That is as poor as it comes. That's his style. I bet Leighton Baines doesn't do that. for Everton, bang 1-0 to Everton in the shootout he's had a good game today as well for me Leighton Baines and this was decisive mine made up, bang he's a free kick taker, Everton's main free kick taker and he smashed that in time for the skipper Manchester United going with the experienced men at the moment Rio Ferdinand on the spot. Saved again! Advantage Everton! Tim Howe the hero. Well, it looked a good penalty to me because he looks to have gone for the corner, Ferdinand. To be honest, it's, it's not there, is it? And it's a nice height for, for Howard. Keeper does excellent, but not the greatest again for Manchester United. What a moment in the life of Phil Neville. Manchester United through and through for much of his career. Made a big, big move in his life four years ago. Now the skipper of Everton. Great opportunity for Phil Neville to emphasise Everton's advantage. And he's taken it, sends Foster the wrong way, and Everton lead by... 2 to nil in the shootout. Well, he's been wonderfully cool all afternoon, Phil Neville, the skipper. And likewise then. It will be the man of the match, Nemanja Vidic, next. But suddenly, Manchester United's bid to win the complete box set is on the line here. But it checks his run and rolls it in just off the post. It's 2-1. Well, in pausing on his run, Howard went and in the end. He was worried for a moment inside of the post. Good enough. James Vaughan arrived very late to this semi-final. But he has a chance here to set up a famous Everton win. Match point, Everton. And the bottom line is that Anderson 
the man who scored the winning penalty here at the start of last month must score, must score, or Everton go to the final. World champions, Carly Cup winners, Champions League semi-finalists, Premier League leaders. But this is the FA Cup in one kick of a ball for Manchester United. It's Anderson, he's done it. He's spared them for now. That's very impressive. I mean, big, big pressure on this and extremely composed. Everton went out of the UEFA Cup on penalties last season. Heartbroken, Phil Jagielka was the man whose penalty was stopped that evening. And Phil Jagielka, it is, with the opportunity to send Everton into the FA Cup final. Everton are in the final! The Manchester United Grand Slam is no more. For the first time since 1995, Everton will contest a major cup final. David Moyes has won the day in a penalty shootout.